Frequency Beings Elohim or Elohim. Angel V. Ornado Jr. June 1, 2018. Earth, Terra, or Mystic Gaia, Mother Planet, existed for more than 5 billion plus years says radiometric age dating it is only during the last 70 million years, we learned it is a planet thriving with animals, minerals, and elemental resources worthy of adulation and admiration by other celestial galactic beings. For visiting galactic beings Terra is only for the exploitation of resources more specifically the mind resources of her animals during this period of evolution of reptilians and mammalians in origin. They are significant for labor and slavery uses, galactic zoo or tourism purposes for the heavens to watch. Eons 65 million years ago, the reptoids reptilian first residents of Terra were extinct, banished through nuclear fusion means. 5,000 years ago, Many other alien species lived and visited our planet with technologies that changed our world and shortened the evolutionary life of living beings to suit the desire and intentions of the colonizing beings for their own purposes. Our planet is resource field planet with animals that can be utilized as slaves if their brains are programmed to follow their coded commands and made to stand upright with little rational intelligence to follow assign hard labor tasks. Literally Earth is a source of work animals with science of the ignorant level says our underground neighbor reptoids and scientists on DNA sequencing. This first species group at inner Earth have vibrational powers of telekinesis, telepathy, and viewing. They say our physics are all wrong with basically no relations to truth like vibrational frequency known to a million rational humans who says our science is wrong. Evolved vibrational beings from other parts of the galaxy. 11 of them are visiting historians working for their own good and 3 are hostile beings who came to exploit our resources says human archaeologists and our co-inhabitant reptoids per their archaeological disc and crystals and stone tablets read and displayed at our libraries and museums taken from Nineveh, Iraq, and Alexandria, Egypt by humans. It is apparent there is a very powerful visitor multidimensional being ultra-advanced compared to other less evolved beings as they can annihilate by thought solar systems and planets at will, a class of one of the best creators in perfect oneness with Source, evolved in billion years no one can mess with. But these beings says the reptoids are omnipotent, omnipresent, and some are observers watchers of the planet for 65 million years, and will never endanger creations of other supreme beings. Let us put it in the proper perspective, there are infinite supreme creator beings and they are in almost oneness with all that is. That is what we aspire for as humans. Our awareness and consciousness are all necessary at this point in time, now. The truth is two warring advanced beings exploiting the planet destroyed Earth for 200 years and wiped out dinosaurs and surface beings of the planet 65 million years ago through nuclear fusion bombs. It is apparent at the 21st century they control the cold or hot wars waging with our leaders. We are so young we are learning fusion bombs for destruction of our planet and asteroids. Beliefs are always a retardant to civilization. Who shall we believe, Elohim, Elohim, inner earth dwellers reptoids, the residents of earth and descendants of the dinosaurs. Reptoids have 65 million years of evolution compared to our lives of 30 million years. Both exist at the Bible or historical records, make your research, learn. Be conscious and aware. Our collective consciousness is required, may decide extinction as what historical records predict what we call revelation. Let us learn what is fake news peddled by mainstream media even other news. Start evolving, raise our consciousness to the next plane. Hostile visitors have intentions only for their good and not for the betterment of Earth which if humans will interpret as evil but in reality is not as they are working for the betterment of their beingness, their support, and that of their living planet wherever they come from. Humans are the same evolving, we colonize continents, kill or demean tribes and ethnic people and made them slaves. The Elohim or Elohim mentioned in our Bible are portrayed as gods but our co-dwellers informed us that they are of a different kind of colonizers or exploiters of animals as we are considered by them as animals forming part of their galactic zoo for genetic manipulation, testing like our guinea pigs for human diseases. Let us pray their intentions for the seventh human generation, are for our fast evolutionary growth as we are helpless on outcomes. Reptoids reptilians of dinosaur lineage are first on Earth but are not important to the genetic manipulators as they are not compatible to their genetic setup who are more of the humanoid type. 
Our monkeys or orangutans on land and trees where present mammalians originated are perfect targets genetically which they did on a continuous basis for eons and still on for results today, now. 30 million years ago, the mammals of our time with dolphins, whales at our oceans, monkeys on land accelerated their evolutionary development. Monkeys are crucial mammalian targets through surgical, DNA manipulations and sequencing, brain and mind control with the bad intent of making them slaves or fodder who became humans for one hostile visitor, Anu. Humans are similar though ignorant in methods in our intent with animals like cattle, caribous, horses, sheep and dogs as they are made beasts of burden, flesh food of humans though unfit for our body makeup as our system is vegetarian in design. Elohim or Elohim planted coded commands, programmed DNA, utilized religion and worship and made themselves the gods of these animals now we call the humankind who evolved very fast as a result of DNA slash surgical genetics and mind commands. After these operations and surgeries, they left and came back either to make the animals extinct or perform trial surgeries again normally every 23,000 years if their desires are not executed or followed by their creators. We are guinea pigs. In Philippines, Filipinos are used as guinea pigs by Europeans using Dengvaxia for dengue vaccine killing 80 children and adults to date, May 28, 2018. Some parents are paid $20, a 1,000 pH pesos to agree for vaccination in public schools. The procedure is followed worldwide says manufacturer. Humans of the 21st century make judgment or common statements as religiously programmed in our minds by the Elohim, good and evil, the light is God and the dark is evil. There is no such thing in evolution. There is always balance as in electromagnetism and we make our individual journey. They are all working for their own benefit to accelerate their own welfare and raise their layered consciousness, raised level vibrational frequency development to oneness with source energy, SE. Four evolving animals on earth are now called humans, 30 million years thereafter with the Elohims as gods, the tall white beings who are ultra-sensitive to our sunlight and may not fall for the qualification of light beings or the crystalline light bodies, beings of multidimensionality but are of themselves have evolved to a level of what humans call gods. Certainly in our understanding of goodness, they are manipulators and are evil in form as they planted in our minds by Elohim, that they are our gods. Awaken and understand. All the first sixth human projects are made extinct by the Elohim and their motives in their next return is a big question for all of us. Their technologies are so advanced, they control nature, volcanoes, elementals, weather, fire, and water. We understand it as big flood or controlled flood. We have not learned about our past as we are made extinct if we are not what they expected, no memories of them. The first sixth level humans are foretold by other human authors. The Elohim visitors of Dr. Georgi e. Stankov are loving good creators with best plans for raising planet Earth and humanity. We sincerely pray they are what our collective consciousness will tell us, the positive righteous beings. They are different but the sound rhymes. Source of all that is has to intervene otherwise game is over if their intentions are extinction similar to the reptilians 65 million years ago and the six human generations, extinct save for the memories and skeletons subjective to radiometric age techniques, known to some nearly ascended human beings of evolutionary events. Tonal slash adaptive magnetic solid and waves are with us, source energy way of helping earth and the human race as pre-qualification cleansing to the next plane. Central slash red suns are showering us with healing, and cleansing magnetic waves, and crystalline rays that eliminate implanted dark codes, and align our DNAs and cellular structure to SE perfection. Reptoid from dinosaurs origin named Lacerda emphasized in her talk, they are not the evil ones portrayed by Elohim as they are earth protectors against invaders and are 30 million years ahead of us, the first Terra species. We got accelerated by the humanoid god geneticist masters for slavery, and fodder of their chosen mammal animals to serve as beast of burden ready for slaughter any time at their convenience, even the whole species they created. We do the same for cattle in Europe if diseases are found to this date 2018. They made six of their human creations extinct, says several spiritual authors in Lacerda who disclose our past. The seventh, 
humans cannot be better if we do not fit their intents and their desires for a good and supportive followers of gods, Elohims. The God information in our genes was planted at the third creation of humans and was carried in future human genome. Self-consciousness and awareness disembody this bad conditioning and with 5,000 years of their absence from Earth, we say that is the reason why we keep telling everyone that we should awaken, develop awareness and concentration and deep consciousness to erase whatever embedded conditioning is left in our minds a million years thereafter. We are on track with our journey but American natives are better off than us as they are fully awakened, aware of who they are, evolving says Christ consciousness and as disclosed by Lacerda, the Reptoid. Reptoid's spaceships come out of oceans and mountains to defend Earth, their planet we cohabit with them. With the war and skirmishes provided by our Earth Reptoids, the Elohim left and destroyed their installations and colonies on Earth. 5,000 years ago today is a short period in evolution but we know every 23,000 years some of these alien species come back for their own reasons. The Nibiru planet has elliptical orbit of 3,400 years and they normally drop by on our planet to haul gold, copper, even silver. Ilojim or Anu, they expect evolution of the animals accelerated or our generation of humans must have produced results for their benefit otherwise extinction level is probable. We expect their return one day to end their project with Earth animals, humans today disputed by religionists, annihilate or extinct the seventh breed of humans, us, humanity or help us to evolve faster. That is what they told the animals then and allowed them to write historical books for 5,000 years to write the Elohim exploits at Mother Earth and come out with misleading record they call ignorant animal beings humans of our generation. Ancient tribes of Americas passed this conditioning awakened and are part of the trinity of saviors of earth with Christ, and the observers and watchers all praying for the raising of earth to the fifth vibrational frequency. If you or any other humans are biased on statements read from historical records that the reptoids or reptilians are evil or of demoniac in origin and are here to destroy earth and humanity, you are in for a surprise, deceived, they are our protectors fighting and defending the planet from resource manipulators out to destroy our lives and host planet. They live at inner earth and defend us from the false teachings of Elohim. Remember, read Anunnaki enslavers, and programmers at in5d.com. The western part of Anu are eliminating the tribe members of America, bomb records in Iraq and Iran for obvious reasons. We will know for finality if the Elohim coming are for real creators, but it is better to be awake, aware, concentrated of our own evolutionary development. Cast out the God conditioning and think of Source all that is, Infinity. Elohim implanted God in our minds. If they are vile or testing science gods, we may have lost our rationality and thinking processes, our pre-programmed beings. If they do not get results, sorry, humans, we lost the game. The reptilians say Elohims are ill-prepared for their journey to all that is, I pray not as they seem to balance the teachings of Christ consciousness. Humanity will have to seek the proper path, the right journey set by Source. Realize Source energy created us to evolve and seek what we like to find on our return to oneness. Light from Angel V. Ornado Jr. NB. Please read Lacerda Files, Reptoid Lady from Sweden, Pravda.online, Luis Prada website, it may open or not your eyes and consciousness. About the author, Angel J.R. shares acts of love, light, and unity consciousness. With Capitalist, he had provided livelihood to where he can at pH, see Shami, a concept that a full stomach learn new ideas. Read Knowing the Infinite Creator by author at Slebris or Amazon.com or link with him at a ornadojr at gmail.com. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Click the bell icon at the top of the page to get notified when I post a new video. Universal Channeling Channeling the Conscious Universe